Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another episode of LSPDFR, guys. Welcome back. Welcome back to episode 60... 67, I think. I said episode 70 last time, but it was not episode 70. And I feel really bad about it, but it's fine. I was way off. So, I am 67, I think. Maybe 66, maybe 68. I don't know. Somewhere around there. I know I'm one away from it, if anything. But, um, today we're going to be using this beautiful, beautiful SUV... Uh, let's look at a nice Ford, an old Ford, uh, uh, oh my gosh, what is it, Expedition, I think, yeah, Ford Expedition. So, um, yeah, it's going to be nice, the lights look really good. I mean, look at that, looks really nice back here, we got the double light bar back here, which is cool, and we're going to be highway patrol, so we're just going to be doing the same thing as we did last episode. Let's say we have a, a traffic stop recording backup, we're going to go and respond to this real quick as we start off. It's going to be a little foggy tonight, so we're going to try to uh, try to look over our vehicle so nothing happens. Let's go ahead and bolt out right here real quick. Just don't want anyone to um, go ahead and go around this guy. That guy wants to stop for some reason, but it's going to be kind of foggy, so it's hopefully we don't get blinded by our lights or anything. Okay, it looks like it's going to be right over here. Let's go ahead and flip around if we can. Looks like that guy has the uh, SUV too, which is cool. Let's go ahead and pull up right next to him. See what he's got going on. Uh, okay, yeah. Oh, look at those lights, man. Look good. Okay. Hey, how's it going, sir? Hey, thanks for coming along. Uh, if you'd like, I need I needed a backup on this one. This vehicle came with a fix and PR camera. Uh, apparently, the registered owner is wanted. Do you want to arrest him? Do you want to arrest to be yours? Uh, yeah, I think I want to do it. I'll do it, guys. I'll do it. Uh, this fellow's mine. I'll, t I'll take the arrest. So I'm going up. No! Whoa. Can I go up there? Hello? Alright, now I can go up. Okay, <laughs> now I can go up. That was weird. Okay. Sir, get out of the vehicle. Out of the vehicle, sir. Please, please. He has a gun. He has a gun. Watch the gun, guys. Watch the gun. Watch it. Watch it. You're pathetic. Okay, we gotta get that gun out of his hand. There we go. Okay, we got it. Let's go ahead and put him under arrest. Looks like that was an AK-47, if I'm not mistaken. Looks like uh, it comes out to a Matteo uh, Guerrero. Is he getting back in his vehicle? Yeah, don't get back in there, man. Whatever you do, don't get back in there. Let's go ahead and put this guy in the back of my back of my SUV here. Let's see if he wants to get back there. Get on back there, man. Get on back there, bro. There he goes. Okay. Go ahead and shut the door for him. Let's go ahead and search his uh, vehicle, see if we can find anything else on it. Let's go ahead and hit 5 on the keyboard there. It's going to open up all the doors. Really, re re really realistic. But guys, I feel really bad for missing the... Uh, was it Wednesday? Yeah, I didn't upload Wednesday, guys. I'm actually recording this on Wednesday, but... This is what happens. This is my schedule, okay? So what I do is I... I record... Uh, around like 7 o'clock. I get done at about 8. And then I, I edit at like 9.30 and I finish at like 10 and then I just render it overnight. And that's that's been my schedule for the entire time. And then the next day I'll upload it and then I'll do the same thing again. So um, that's what happened. But last night there was an action, there was a power outage at like 9 o'clock. So I had no power from like 9 to 1 in the morning, which is a struggle. But uh, we got it fixed, luckily. I guess there was a main, like, I guess one of our green boxes was leaking, so we had to get that fixed. But, I mean, it's no big deal. Just missed an, uh, missed an upload, which happens, you know. Life happens. Life is hard sometimes, so it happens. But uh, we're going to be back on the grind. I might upload on Saturday just because I missed it, because I do have an extra uh, video, because I recorded and everything. I just needed to edit it, but I didn't do it. So I might, I might post on Saturday, so be on the lookout for that, too. And, and this tow truck is going to go ahead and pick up his vehicle. And then we're going to go ahead and get out of here once we search up his name. Yeah, yeah. We're going to search up his name real quick. Let's go ahead and see what it comes up to. Let's go put that away. Um, Matteo Gaelda. Perfect. And um, what was I going to say? Shoot, I don't even know. License, license suspended. I was going to say that we're using the uh, Siren Mastery thing again, guys. I'm actually really enjoying it. It's kind of fun to use. And, um, I mean, I'm pretty. it's pretty cool. So he is wanted. So we're going to go ahead and take him down to the station real quick. Go ahead and get out here real quick. Uh, real quick, real quick, real quick. <laughs> Just going to get over here. But we're going to be going to be 10 8, guys. Robbery in Palato Bay. Guys, we have a robbery in Palato Bay. Let's go ahead and take this. I just went ahead and dropped off that, that one guy from the ANRP 
the traffic requiring the traffic stop requiring backup. We're gonna go and respond to this uh, code three, I think. Let's go ahead and yeah, let's go ahead and find out code three. Try to get over there pretty quick. So I think we're in a. Hold on, let me press V real quick. That's better. Okay, now we can actually see. Try to get through these intersections here. Really foggy out. Really foggy out. Try to get through. Try to get to these guys real quick. See what's gonna go on. Okay, it looks like it's this store right here. Try to get in here. Make sure everyone's all safe. Looks like you shot at me. 10-4. We got shots fired. Shots fired. Roll EMS. Roll EMS over here. Attention all units. This is uh, Officer Brodovich. It's requiring backup. Get some backup here. Make sure we're all clear. I'm going to clear the room. Make sure we're clear here. Sir, stay to the ground, sir. I need you to stay on the ground. So it's clear back here. Look at myself in the mirror. <laughs> Clearing back here. Okay, looks like it is clear. Looks like we're good to go. I'm going to go check around this side, too. I didn't really check over here that well. Yeah, we're clear. 10-4. All right, looks like the guy is right here, so we can press N to talk to him. Attention. All right, so we're at code four. I uh, hopefully the uh, the ambulance is going to come by. It looks like my units have responded. I think the uh, the mech's going to come in here in any second now. Try to check him out if they can. Oh man, this is a beautiful sight. You see all these lights and stuff. Wow, it's beautiful. All right, is is the medic going to come over here or no? I don't think he is. Okay, so. He's not. That's fine. I'm just gonna try to call a coroner then, maybe. Damn you to hell. Are they? Are they like stuck? Hold on. Are you guys stuck or what? Oh no, one guy's gone. Is he in there? Oh, he's in there. Oh, what's up, dude? Okay, I shot him in the head, so I don't think this guy's gonna live. But we'll have to see. He's on the desk. He's on the counter. What are you doing? It's just not legit at all. Alright, this guy looks like he's gonna be deceased here, so we're gonna go ahead and get a coroner down here and then have them go to pick up his dead body. Looks like the wound is to the neck, not to the head. Okay. That's what the EMS said. He said it was the wound is to the neck. Not that big of a deal, but we're gonna get a coroner down here and then clean up the scene. But um yeah, that was an easy one, guys. That was a I actually really enjoyed that one. I like responding here really quick and it's like an actual cop thing, you know, it's kinda cool. So the coroner's gonna come over here, clean them up. Who's grinding? Bay. Sir, if you're gonna grind a, sir, sir, step out of the car. Get out of the car, sir. Hold on, let me go ahead and talk to this guy. Hey, get on the ground. Oh, this is Lamar from Kendrick Lamar from last episode. Can I get the same peds all the time? All right, sir, I want to go and place you under arrest. I'm detaining you right now for um, disturbing a crime scene. Um, can I see your uh, ID, sir? I'm gonna probably let this guy go. I just wanted him to realize that that's a bad thing to do. Okay, so let's go ahead and hold E to Put release him. Away. Don't, don't. Let's go ahead and release this guy. They're both coming out of the car. These guys are idiots. I'm out of here. I'm out. Okay, looks like we're gonna we're all cleaned up. The body has been picked up, so we're gonna be at code four, guys. Whoa. Okay, we got a fugitive going about 77 into this right turn. He almost actually 1050 into this guy up in front of him here. Almost rear ended. I'm going to go ahead and check this guy out. See if we can uh, we pull this guy over. Yeah, he's going quick. Let's go ahead and try to see if we can uh, initiate traffic stop on this guy. Let's go ahead and turn on our lights, too. Uh, what are you going to do, man? Are you going to pull over or what? He's going to want to just go right here. Okay, let's go ahead and get over just a little bit more, man. Perfect. There we go. Sweet. Okay, so let me go ahead and get behind them. Try to get traffic to a standstill. Try to keep them nice and calm so they don't run me over. Let's go ahead and talk to this guy though. See why he was doing 77. Hey, how's it going? Looks like I, uh, vehicles occupied times too. Uh, vehicle seems pretty clean. Uh, okay, so, hello Go sir. Uh, why are you calling 77 up. back there? Hmm? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, so. Alright, so we got his license. Go ahead and search it up. It's gonna be John Carlton? Carlton. Car okay, I spelled that totally wrong. Car Carlton. John Carlton. There we go. Perfect. Go ahead and see what comes up. Life's about no active warrant. So he's pretty much clean. Let's go ahead and go into here. Check out his uh, vehicle. Make sure his vehicle's clean. Too. A fugitive can get pretty speedy, you know. And looks like he's valid though. Yeah, so he's all clean. Born in nineteen ninety seven, so pretty much just got his license a couple of um 
couple of years ago, so he's a pretty much new driver, so I don't think he should be driving like that. We're going to go ahead and uh, give him a ticket as well. And now what I've realized, guys, is I've been giving these guys Hi. tickets for only 250 bucks, and that's not a lot for a ticket. So I'm going to start going back up. I think a speeding fine is about 750 bucks in California. So we're going to go ahead and uh, and just give him that, and he's going to have to pay 750 bucks in court. Ooh, that's a struggle, but... No big deal. No big deal for me. I just give them out. You know, they're like coupons for me. I just love love having them. But um, so we're going to give this guy about a $750 citation for uh, exhibition of speed and speeding. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and be uh, 10 8 off of this one, guys. See you guys later. Officers report a criminal resisting arrest. Okay, so we have a pursuit in highway. progress. We're going to go ahead and respond to this uh, code 3 here. Let's see if we can get over there real quick. See if we can, um, let's see he's up in the mountains, I think, uh, see if we can get this, this is going to be a tricky one to get through here, make sure we're all clear. Is he going to try to come through here? Let's go and try to block him off. Oh, he's coming off of that one. Alright, let's see, oh gosh, it's so hard to try to control, uh, uh, Siren Mastering the same thing, it's, it's, it's rough. Oh, oh, see, I'm not even looking, I don't even know where I'm going. Let's see if I can, <laughs> okay, he looks like he jumped on the main road, we're going to be going northbound on the, uh, no, northbound. We're probably gonna be going eastbound. Yeah, we're gonna be going eastbound on the Route One. I'm checking out this guy. He is flying. Let's see if we can catch up. He do, looks like he does. A, he has a motorcycle. Yeah, yeah, a motorcycle. Okay. Let's see with the motorcycle. We gotta, we, we gotta take it kind of easy here. Uh, okay, this is gonna be rough, guys. This is gonna be really rough. I'm trying to talk like as much as I can, but it's so hard to talk. Are you gonna, are you gonna flip around or what? It's so hard to talk with, uh, like, trying to do Siren Master and all this stuff, guys. So, if I, if I don't talk, if there's, like, a space, that's why. Is that the bike that's all bugged out? Yeah, look at the look at the blue lights on the bike. I think it's a little too big for the bike, don't you think? <laughs> the lights. That's wrong. Don't look at that bike. That bike was, I, I installed it wrong, so. <laughs> and if you guys think, you guys, you're the only one that installs vehicles wrong in, in LSPDFR, you're not. I always do it. Everybody always does it. It's how it goes, but, um, let's see if we can, just so it's got to calm down, you know. Looks like it's a girl. I'm not, I'm not used to that, usually. All right. Ma'am, you need to pull over the vehicle, ma'am. Pull over the vehicle. Feels like she's not complying here. I'm going to go ahead and get some backup. Oh, do not mean to bump her. Get some backup here. Get a local air unit. Try to get them in here so we not lose them. Looks like she is still continuing. I don't know how to treat bikes. I think we just had to stay, in, uh, stay for a, uh, a pursuit on them just to make sure they stay, uh, they stay safe. Cause it looks like she's not wearing a helmet as well, so that's going to be another concern. So we do not want to bump her off. We just want to try to maybe slow her down if we can and then um, go from there. But, uh, oh my gosh. Whoa, 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 I can't, I'm trying to learn how to use all this stuff, and it just, it's rough at the same time. I'm trying to get all this, pull over, ma'am. Pull over! I love how you can do the horn, too, on it, I mean, it's pretty sick. See, there it goes, okay, gosh, I'm so bad at this. Alright, ma'am, we're gonna have to, okay, so I'm gonna go and try to get in front of her if I can. Try to get a traffic to move over. I have more control, I mean, more control, um, over the way V installed, so that should help a little bit too. Let's see if I can get her to stop. Oh, okay. It looks like she ran, ran into my vehicle. That wasn't me running into her, by the way. That was all her coyote. Oh my god. She just hit a coyote. We both did. <laughs> okay. So it looks like the uh, the helicopter is staying on her too, so that's good. We're going to go and try to get in front of her again. Try to slow her down here. Okay, yeah. She is not wanting to slow down. And my cruiser is not fast enough. We're going to go and call in a couple more backups here. See if they can maybe catch up to her and slow her down. Looks like we do have one. Is she going to run into one of them? Oh, that was close. Man, that was really close. Jeez. Okay, yeah, we're still going to be continuing on uh, US Route 13. We're going to be going southbound right off of Grand Sonora Desert. Okay, so um, I just uh, told dispatch that we are still continuing. So I don't know what we're going to do here. I'm going to try to get in front of her, slow her down again. Looks like her headlight is out, so we're gonna be she's going black right now. Which is a struggle. Okay. Looks like we're slowing her down just a little bit here. I'm gonna try to get a rolling roadblock. Okay, yeah, no. 
Not, she does not like that. And here's everybody doing their illegal U-turns right there. That's where I got a patrol, right there, where the illegal U-turns happen. Man. So I catch up to her. I, cops should have like a nice nit not nitrous in their vehicle and just you get to nitrous it out and just go catch up to her. Freaking idiot. I'm gonna catch up to her. If it comes down to me hitting her off, I might do it. So let's try to do this here. Let's see if she's gonna... Oh, I spun out. Okay. Oof. Go ahead, guys. I'll drop down to... There's a stupid bike. Just die already, bike. You don't, you're not even helpful. Okay. Looks like I'm trying to continue here. Hopefully we don't lose her. We have a helicopter still on her, so... Oh! What are you guys doing? God, they're idiots. Jeez. Okay. So, the helicopter's the only one that actually knows what to do in a pursuit. I guess, because he's still with her. All my other units are way back there. I guess they're just following me. That's my... That might... This... Because if you hit one, you hit the Pursuit Tactics. See this up here in the left-hand corner? And I think we just hit Automatic Tactics. And now they're safe. No, we do not want them aggressive. That's for sure. We just want them safe. Okay, let's just... Yeah, let's just have them safe. So I think when they're safe... I think... Do I go this way? Gosh, what am I doing? Yeah, this guy's just going to bump me. This is a mess. This is a mess. This is a mess! What are you doing?! Oh my gosh. We totally lost her. Oh, I'll be back in a second once I catch up to her. Jesus. God! Alright guys, I'm right over here. I had to go through the tunnel. I, I made a wrong turn, but looks like she went ahead and went onto the actual, um... Okay, we're gonna have to turn around right here. She went onto the actual pier, I think. So we're gonna go ahead and try to go onto the sand. See if we can, uh... Okay, so what am I even doing? Please tell me. Yeah, there's so many key bindings, and I have to shift and hit 3 to turn off the priority, and it's just... The struggle so let's go ahead and just try to get over here it looks like they have a corner at the end of the pier so um maybe i can get up on these stairs right here i see if i can uh oh what was that oh okay go ahead and crash thank you all right guys let's see what it was let's see what made us crash you guys want to see this let's see that let's go ahead and scroll down here what did it, what was it new ped recognizes cop what Setting up new cop until what? Fail to find unit dispatch, reverting to random voice. I don't know what that was. I might have to look in the regular file. Let's go ahead and exit here. Take a look here. I kind of want to show you guys this just a little bit. Here's my thumbnails. Let's go ahead and put this off to the side here. But what the heck was that? I haven't had the game crash for me in a long time. Um, was it this? It's probably this is going to show us right here. Direct X. Yeah, no, this is not it. This is not... Yeah, 613. Yeah, that's not... Oh, no, we want to go down lower. Right here. Yeah, so it's just the same thing. Huh, so it must have been... Uh, it doesn't really show me what it was, but I guess I'll just play again, but... No, I'm kidding, guys, but uh, we'll, we'll just next next episode, I'll get all this sorted out. But hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. It's going to come off to a weird ending on this one, but, you know, it's kind of cool. Kind of exciting. I love how we have weird endings like that. But hopefully you guys have enjoyed. And if you guys did, hit like button below. If you guys want to see more of a channel saying Broad Visions, guys, go check it out. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be Broad Visions signing out. Peace out, guys. See you guys later. Uh -huh.